Hello my friends, tonight we're going to talk about a cartel market item that I swore that I would never use, but I did. Let's talk about it. Hello my SOTOR brothers and sisters out there. How is everyone doing? This is Boomy here once again with another video for you. My friends, as I said in the beginning, interlude, not really a monologue, more of a hello, this was uh, suspense. What shall we be talking about today? Well, <clears throat> let's just get into it, right? So, I'm a big leveling freak. I love to level. I love to experience all the things in all the games when it comes to leveling, when it comes to story, when it comes to the environment, to everything that the developers have put in front of us as per for our leveling experience out there in the world. But sometimes, for like instance, we have companions coming back and we're just like, oh no, I don't think I've ever romanced them on this particular tune or oh man i don't have a i don't have a male and or female tune that um is you know coincides with this companion that's coming back and i don't have the time to level one to 70 just to get it through all the content and i'm a big story person i love going through the stories of sotor so i you know i personally believe that like sotor i know i know don't shoot me when i say this but I find the story in Sotor, the Old Republic, and all that lore far richer than the Star Wars movies, especially the new ones. But that aside, don't unsub yet. Don't do it yet. There's a reason for my madness. <laughs> we have these companions that are returning, and they're, they're coming. And sometimes we might find ourselves in a situation like, oh, man, I don't have time to do this. Well... That dovetails into what we're going to talk about today with the cartel market. That little pesky thing and, oh, look at me, I didn't do that. Look, now she's talking, that's good. So, um, the guitar, the guitar market, every time, the cartel market, yes, it's a thing. There's a nifty little doohickey on there that I swore that I would never use, that I would never purchase. And I was a big fat liar we're talking about the master's datacron this big puppy right here that's right but what is the master's datacron so the master's datacron will get you from level one or whatever lower level you are to level 70 end game level now one of the cool things about this is what you get in this is the eternal commander equipment bundle and this gets you this gets you to item level 230 so you don't have to worry much, especially of a companion by your side, because, you know, if you subscribe April 3rd to, I believe, April 5th, you can get your companions, Shea Vizsla and Nico Car. You get them, you won't die. You just will not die. This is, this is the cool thing. Now, the downside to this, but I kind of consider it an upside, is you can, it doesn't, like, fast forward you straight to Kotet, well, it, it can, but you don't get to experience the story. So it, in, in other words, it doesn't automatically say, yep, well, you did all the story for your, uh, for, you know, the vanilla content and, you know, well, go, go ahead and have fun. No, this still means you can, you'll be able to run all your vanilla content, your story for that class that you just dinged up to level 70 with fresh eyes. No, it's not all completed yet. You can go back and enjoy it. And I think that's a very smart thing to do. I mean, it allows, at least for me, and this, you might feel different, but at least for me, it gives us a chance to, you know, to go through the story. We might have gone through the story before, but we're going to relive the story. We're going to go see things again with new and fresher eyes. And, you know, well, we might remember some things, which I did. I'm like, oh, my gosh, I don't remember doing this at all when I leveled my first Sork, who is my crafting queen in the whole world. And I enjoyed it, and I felt a more closer connection to Ashara when I was leveling that tune um, with her than me going, wait, which companion is coming back? I don't remember her quite well. Oh, yes, she's that one. It's a good thing. It helps you get through the story, and you don't die, so you, are, you, you aren't handicapped, even with the, with the level sinks on, this, on the planet, which you know, we'll talk about that some other day. 
But no, you blow through, you will blow through everything. You can even, you'll even blow through Kotet and coffee. Let me tell you, you, you blow through it. But it's good. It gets you through the story. It gets you through point A to point end with that still fresh in your brain. You're like, wow, it's been like six years for this guy. But really, it's been, I don't know, a week and a half. And it's right there. And that I really enjoyed that about that. I enjoyed the item level going up. So with that said, it can be pretty pricey. You're looking at a 2,000 cartel coin investment when it comes to the master's datacron or you can go on the gtn and spend like i bought one on the gtn and bought it for 21 million uh yeah 21 million credits ouchie Ugh. because i'm like well i don't want to spend my cartel coins but oh but i have these credits i'm like oh what do i do and i bought it and i don't regret it I don't regret it at all. A little bit I do because I'm like, oh, I'm so cheap when it comes to in-game currency. It's not even funny. But if you have the cartel coins in there, go ahead, do it. If you if you find yourself in a position like, man, I really want to level this, but I don't know if I have that much time. But I want to enjoy the story without having to worry about, about um, no, do am I going to die? Oh, I got our gear. Gear up and make sure this is gear. Oh, I might have to mod my gear. You don't even need to worry about that now. You get everything when you do it, and you just play. And that's one of the things I liked about it is that you just get to play. You don't really need to worry. I don't think I died at if I did, it was because of my own stupid fault. But you just get to play. You get to enjoy the story again. And then when you get to the part, you're like, wow, that was cool. Total worth. Totally worth it. Is it a little pricey? Yeah, it might be. I, I don't know. Maybe 1,500 cartel coins. 2,000, it's in the middle ground. At least it's not 5,000, right? Am I right? Is it worth it? Most definitely, I believe it's worth it. It allows you to do what you need to do without having to worry behind it. And if you don't even want to do the story, you can jump in with your friends. Done, you're level 70, you're pretty much, you're at level, I, you know, 730, 230, 730, what am I, World of Warcraft? 230, and you're already getting your um, Galactic Command stuff going on there. Which, let me tell you, most of it doesn't even matter because you're already 2.30, so... Yeah. But you're still getting stuff there. Party on, right? Because we love the Galactic Command. Anyways, carrying on. But yeah, you can go play with your friends. You don't even need to worry about it anymore. And cartel coins are pretty easy to uh, acquire nowadays. That's my thing about the Master's Datacron. I think you should go get it. I've enjoyed it, and I will use it again in the future. Just sit down pop it and play and enjoy the game you love and that's really the most important part of playing a game right enjoying it having fun put your comments in the comment section below what you think do you think it's cheating i don't think it's cheating it's definitely not pay to play but what do you think about have you used the master's data cron or are you like yeah i don't know i don't know about that i don't know whatever your thoughts are bonk, 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 put it in the comment section below and we'll have a conversation Make sure to hit that like button if you like what you see here. And if you don't, downvote the poop out of it. My beard still sees everything you do. And if you really like what you see here, make sure you hit that sub button and uh, become part of the freak show here, the Black Sheep of SOTOR, where all this freaky geeky people get around and, you know, play with lightsabers because nothing can go wrong when you do that. So hit that subscribe button. We'd love you forever. My friends, remember always to be kind. And it's about community. And we'll see you later. Good day.